Cobb angle. The Cobb angle measurement is used for evaluation of curves in scoliosis on an AP radiographic projection of the spine. When assessing a curve, the apical vertebra is first identified. This is the most likely displaced and rotated vertebra with the least tilted end plate. The end or transitional vertebra are then identified through the curve above and below. The end vertebras are the most superior and inferior vertebras that are least displaced and rotated and have the maximally tilted end plate. A line is drawn along the superior end plate of the superior end vertebra and a second line is drawn along the inferior end plate of the inferior end vertebra. The angle between these two lines is measured as the Cobb angle. In S-shaped scoliosis where there are two contiguous curves the lower end vertebra of the upper curve represents the upper end vertebra of the lower curve. In some cases, there may be a third contiguous curve. As a general rule, a Cobb angle of 10 is regarded as a minimum angulation to define scoliosis.